Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this product review video. Appreciate your time and your support. Huge shout out to Poetic for sending me the Black Poetic Revolution for my Google Pixel 4 XL. We're going to get a good look at this case in just a couple minutes. We'll slap it on my Google Pixel 4 XL. We're going to take a, a thorough look at not just what the case looks like, but making sure that all the cutouts are precise and get a good look at what's going to protect your investment. Now, as always, there will be a link down below in the description area. Hit that link. It'll send you on over to Amazon. And it is there that you're going to find out all the information that you need to know about the Poetic Revolution, especially that price point. And let me tell you right now, it's a great price point. All that information is going to be right here. But remember, the link will be down below in that description area. So do not forget to hit that link. Also, Check out all the other cases that Poetic has for a lot of other smartphones. Huge catalog of cases. You can't go wrong with Poetic. So we're going to go ahead and get into this very simple but nice presentation. Yeah, Poetic. Okay, we'll put that over to the side. We do have a built-in screen protector and we have a kickstand. P for Poetic. Poetic right down in here as well. Man. I'm telling you, man, these cases are great. Full protection, full body protection, rugged protection. Military drop tested. Okay, right in here, we're going to pull this two piece full body rugged case apart without damaging that screen protector. It's a durable screen protector, so you're not gonna have to be too careful. Okay, so we got all that out of the way. Put that over there. And also in the box, there's always one of these in the box. Installation guide. If you've never used this type of case, read the information here it will help you I've used many of these cases so I pretty much know what I'm doing but if you don't just take a quick look read over it yeah it will help okay so what we're gonna do is put the frame of the case that has the built-in screen protector this is a hard plastic polycarbonate frame I'm going to turn off. Of course, it's going to come back on. For those of you that work in a really rough and tough environment, consider this case. And for those of you that just can't seem to hold on to your smartphone, consider this case. Maybe you just like this type of case just because... It's bold, it's strong, it's solid. And that's what you like to sport on your smartphone? Then this is for you. Okay, so we're gonna start out at the bottom. Use my desk as a tool to help me along the way. Probably should turn off all the notifications. Okay. I'll do that here in just a second. There we go, silence. And then you wanna press the TPU bumper that's all around the back part of the case. You wanna press up against the frame of the case. Bringing both pieces together like that. Okay. A firm press. And there we go. Bringing the seams together. You see that? Here's that kickstand. That's nice. Totally digging that if you want to watch movies, videos. Um, yeah, man. I watch a lot of videos and movies on my smartphone. And uh, let's see. Down below, you have speaker cut out there. A lot of depth to protect from lint and dust and dirt. And your USB Type-C charging port area. That area is going to be really well protected, so that's really, really cool. 
And what we're going to do is try out a third party cable, make sure that we have a lot of space in there. And I can already tell we do. And bam, just like that. Got your mic over here up top, you got a mic. Nothing over here on the left hand side, on the right hand side, the power button, which works really well. And face unlock just like that. And very clicky and responsive. Volume down and volume up. So what we're gonna do is test out the display with two screw protectors. Just like that. I'm giving it a little extra pressure, applying extra pressure, but really you don't even have to do that. It's pretty fluid, man. That 60 hertz refresh rate is just phenomenal. Bam. So anyway, everything seems to be working really fluid with two screen protectors. That is awesome. And I'm not really applying as much pressure as I thought I was going to have to apply. So, uh, but I'm giving you that information just in case you decide you want to have a the screen protector you already have on your Google Pixel 4 XL and the uh, built-in one as well. You don't want to remove it and you just want to go with two of them. There you go. You're just going to have to give it a little extra. That's and really that's it. So what we're going to do is take a couple pictures. I'm going to be putting those pictures right in there. Uh, that way you can see the quality of the pictures. We got Robin here. Okay. And there's Robin sharp sharp picture look at that dust down there so you'll get that right in there and uh then we're gonna do a selfie okay there i am making sure that the cutouts on not just the built-in one but the one that i already have on there so i got two you can you can kind of see them layered on top of each other right there and uh, the selfie pic will be in there as well. But man, the quality is great. You cannot go wrong. All right. So that being said, we're going to test out wireless charging as well. It's a thick case. So what you want to do is just find that sweet spot. Bam. Just like that. Man, I love it when it works the first time. But if it doesn't, just move it around. Okay. That's all you have to do. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. So we took a couple, well, we took one picture. Well, we took a couple pictures. One, one on the rear, one on the front. We tested out the third-party USB Type-C cable. We checked out the um, kickstand. Now let's look at the depth going on there protect those cameras, those two 12 megapixel shooters, regular wide and telephoto. So yeah, a lot, a lot of depth when setting down on flat surfaces and even a little bit of a rough surface, you're going to have a lot of protection there, a lot. And you can see that there's plenty of lip, a lot of depth there as well. A lot of depth. That's awesome. Okay, so when setting down on flat surfaces, again, the surface can be a little rough, but I'm very um, picky about where I set my smartphones down, so I typically go flat anyway, even when I have that much protection, that much lip, that much depth back there. Protect those cameras. You just do not want to do anything to those cameras. Man, that looks great. All right, this is the Poetic Revolution Black with kickstand, with built-in screen protector, Two-piece case, full-body rugged, military, brought tested. <sighs> what more can you ask for? Shout out to Poetic. Totally digging it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching, everyone. Till my next video, this is my Project 13. Peace.